Hey everyone. Now, usually I don't talk music, but sometimes you hear a band that is just so bad that you wonder how this band sells any records and how they get radio airplay. And I'm going to talk about this band called 21 Pilots. If the band only has two members, why are they called 21 Pilots? That's like 19 more pilots than we need it. Alright, he's critiquing my question. Yeah. What's a blurry face? Hey there, fanboys and fangirls! I'm your host, Thinking the Pilot, and today I'm going to be telling you the top 10 rules of the clique. I don't like it. <laughs> it's your boy, Not Slick, and if you listen to 21 Pilots, you are dumb. 21 Pilots has always been the band that you don't tell your friends you listen to because it's made for girls and boys that don't know real music. You guys need to seriously get with the times. 21 Pilots has always found its audience in the nerdy kids in school, the people that you don't like to hang out with at lunch. But unfortunately, all these nerds just can't stop talking about how supposedly great this band is when in reality, it's just trash. And if you like 21 Pilots, you are f And I'm not saying that to be mean. I'm just trying to make the world a better place. 21 Pilots makes music for those edgy teenagers that don't know what real music is. And as they're growing up, someday they will look back at 21 Pilots and think, damn, that was the shittiest band I've ever listened to in my life. Real music is rap. Like Eminem, real music is rap. Real music is rap. If you don't listen to rap nowadays, you are a b and I don't even want to have to talk to you, okay? Rappers like Kendrick Lamar, Childish Gambino, and Logic are the real powerhouses in the music industry, not this weak ass sh**. You can't listen to 21 Pilots and call yourself cool. It's not how the world works. I am smart, and that I have friends, and that I that I'm cool and popular, and none of it's none of it's true. I get bullied. <laughs> now I know for sure if that if any of you guys that listen to 21 Pilots have girlfriends, your girl is probably cheating on you. Like, not gonna lie, she for sure is. She's probably cheating on you with a guy that listens to rap music. Like that song Stressed Out is one of the worst and shittiest songs I've ever heard in my life. And for some reason it's just insanely popular. This shit needs to stop. This band is trash. And you guys need to just wake up and find better music. Because if you don't and you let this normie ass shit become more popular, it will only get worse. And then more bands will start copying it. And then pretty soon, we're going to be surrounded by all these <laughs> Like the people in 21 Pilots making the music industry even worse. Shut your face. Oh, it, it was bad. It was bad. They weren't bad songs, but I'd say they were bad for 21 Pilots standards. If I were to boys. say... On jump, what's our for jumpsuit? Um, the, the the bigger song. It has its own music video, of course. It's definitely the music video is a little weird, in my opinion. Tyler Joseph's vocals were just so weird. I, I don't, I don't get it. the vocals. I didn't like them in this song. They were just they were kind of bad. If I were to say boys. bad, bad, bad. Do you guys, would you guys say yeah. you're uh, you're bad boys? <laughs> um, I'm just kidding. The way you said that was very interesting. I would say if I were to boys. say if I were to say like Josh is a bad boy, <laughs> right now good at all. it just could be taken in so many ways. So it, it was a weird style of vocals, and it felt kind of weird for me. The the vocals, I can't get used to them. And now for Nico and the Niners, not like it was like something that you'd find on Blurry Face, like one of the weaker songs. But the weird part with all the uh, vocals, pitch shifting and everything, it just felt kind of out of place and weird. And it was like, uh, ee, uh, ee. I mean, honestly, these songs were kind of a letdown after a year of 
their hiatus. But they were kind of bad for 21 Pilots standards, in my opinion. Well, ding dong, your opinion's wrong. We're, we're scared of our moms, and, and they always, like, beat us yeah. relentlessly if we do something bad. The upcoming Trench, which is coming out in October of this year. With the announcement of this album, the band released two new songs, Jumpsuit and Nico and the Niners, and they're two of the worst songs the band have ever done. These songs are just so painfully average that they leave me with almost nothing to talk about. We've got those two new singles to talk about now, Jumpsuit and Nico and the Niners. Jesus Christ, these songs absolutely suck. Jumpsuit starts off really promising with this really great new slash royal blood sounding opening riff and then the lyrics come in and they're just so bafflingly bad like they may have some deep meaning behind them but that doesn't mean they're anything decent jumpsuit jumpsuit cover me being repeated over and over again gets incredibly repetitive like pretty much the second time he says it nico and the niners is just flat out awful it's so annoying and repetitive there's nothing in it that i think is even worthwhile it carries on with that reggae influence from their last album but does absolutely nothing interesting or unique with it and tyler's vocal delivery is just terrible i, I absolutely hate it i don't care i don't <laughs> I was a 21 Pilot fan before anyone else, so therefore it's my band, you know? This is important to me. This is this was made for me. We own it because we, we like it. I liked them back when they were playing in their garage. Well, you know, I'm glad that they're successful and I want them to be successful and reach mm -hmm. the heights that they do. But at the same time, it's like, well, where were you guys in the first place? Why weren't you there and seeing it when I, you know, why didn't you see it when I saw it? It's cool to be the person that shows somebody a band that they never heard before that they fall in love with. So then when everyone falls in love with them, you you just get that sense of like, well, I was there first. <laughs> somebody <laughs> give me credit over here. Like, I, I don't know if I'm gonna go to another Twenty One Pilots show. They're like, I don't want to pay a bunch of money, and, and the, like the crowd has gotten younger. It's different, man. That's another thing too is when you listen to them when they're younger and they're getting bigger, and then you're starting to see like. 18 year olds listening to high school kids and you're like oh god no they've got the oh, younger no. crowd i think the average age it shows like 17. i almost pooped my pants that's true it's <laughs> true yeah. i was there yeah so instead of doing that let's talk about my opinion of the band as a whole i don't care they're singing about how sad they are so all the scene teenage girls can identify with them. Regional at best is a really weird album. Slowtown sucks. Lyrically, it's one of the most ridiculous songs they've ever done. There's also lyrics about Pokemon cards in there, and as well as the lyrics being terrible, the production and songwriting in general is just pretty lackluster. The children choir sections are really annoying as well. The melodies and hook are unremarkable. It's it's just straight up filler. Be Concerned is basically just kitchen sink, but with incredibly annoying vocal. Migraine has a really, really terrible first verse. Cause some days are my suicide days. Is one of the dumbest lyrics I've ever heard in my entire life. In fact, lyrically, this song is quite bad in general. It's exactly what people think of when they think about this band. Them singing about mental health in a way that is far from original and seems way too pandering to feel genuine. Heavy, dirty soul. Although some of the lyrics are incredibly terrible. Death inspires me like a dog. It's probably one of the cringiest lyrics on the entire album. This really cliche, dark imagery, which is at times kind of cringy. Lane Boy, Again, lyrically, it could be a lot better. The second verse is especially pretty bad. Message Man would have been a good song if the lyrics weren't so painfully average. I have dark thoughts and so do all my followers is the basic premise for the song and it's just so bland. What did you say? I don't care. Mm, mm, mm. 21 Pilots.
21 Pilots is a horrible band that makes an original and crappy music. The music is total garbage. Their music is completely forgettable. It's the exact same rock beats that you hear every single time. In every generic rock song, the music sounds like it should be in the store. Their singing is horrible. It is very hard to listen to their music. Oh!